Looking for two-wheeler or three-wheeler motor control with reduced cycle time from prototype to production? Microchip offers you a compact, ready-to-build e-scooter traction motor control reference design. The package features a modular design with separate power and control boards to enable ease of scaling. The design can deliver a continuous power of 3 kilowatts and a peak power of up to 6 kilowatts at 48 volts. The power stage includes 80-volt 250-ampere MOSFETs, half-bridge-gate drivers rated up to 100 volts with integrated shoot-through protection, DC link capacitors, and MOSFET temperature sensors. The control stage features a 200 MHz 80-pin microchip DS PIC DSC, Allegro Hall Effect current sensors, hardware overcurrent and overvoltage protection, and 4 MB onboard flash. The design supports sensor-based FOC for PMSMs, BLDCs, and AC induction motors. To achieve a wide torque versus speed characteristic, MTPA and field weakening are implemented. The design can be operated in torque and cruise control modes, and in all four quadrants. The firmware is designed to support various position feedback options, ranging from low-resolution 120-degree hall sensors to high-resolution inductive position sensors. To implement limited performance mode, the firmware uses a two-level protection scheme with dynamic torque limiting. The firmware is designed to detect position sensor failure, phase loss failure, and safely shut down the motor controller. To establish interconnection between various onboard subsystems, the firmware supports UART and CAN communications. For rapid prototyping and testing, the design comes with a graphical user interface that provides real-time monitoring, fault indications, motor parameters, controller parameters, driver parameters, derived base parameters, torque versus speed curve information, speed position feedback parameters, constraint-based dynamic torque limit parameters, and fault level parameters. The zero speed peak torque capability of the drive is demonstrated using a hub motor brake drum test bench. The regeneration capability of the drive is demonstrated in back-to-back -back dyno testing. In this test, the power drawn from the supply mains is 500 watts, and the shaft power is 1.5 kilowatts, indicating that 1 kilowatt is regenerated. For more details, refer to the reference design page on the Microchip website.